Alright. We are right here on the second floor yeah, of the plaza. We're right by Vans and the mall offices, Air Cristal. But, um, we have another similar store to Forever 21. Uh, by the way, uh, many of these changes have happened like up to two weeks back because I've been able to be filming lately. I've seen them, but I haven't filmed them. Ready? That's the former location of Modell's, and this is the former location of the temporary entrance, and I think like three, two or three other stores. Yeah. So, I guess they're converting that into a two-level H&M. We're probably going to get a Schindler with that, and then for the Forever 21, we'll either get Kone, because that's what they usually install, uh, an Otis, because that is, th there was an Otis truck, or a ThyssenKrupp. There could be a ThyssenKrupp, because, I don't know if you can see it, but right up there, that's the NAC, or K-N-A-A-C-K, you know, that service hangar that they have. Here's your escalators. Yeah. Oh, uh, a few seconds ago when I said Otis, uh, the Otis truck, there was an Otis truck right outside Forever 21, and it looked like they were doing some service in here, so I don't know, it could be one of the three brands. But Schindler, I doubt it doubt that it's going to be Schindler. So, yeah, they've been doing a lot of work. Entrance is open up, but the uh, sliding glass part of the entrance, for some reason it's closed. It was open a few days ago. I don't know what happened. Um, so, yeah. Um, I've done some work, like putting a store frame, something like that around around it. I'm not sure where the elevator will go. It's probably near the NAC, the service hangar. So it might be right in the middle there. That could also be the location of the escalators. There's a little, I guess, like emergency exit or something, or maybe one of those entrances where you bring the cars in, you know. I don't know. Looks like it's going to be part of the mall, though. Part of Forever 21. And look, it looks like Forever 21 gets their own little loading dock entrance, so they don't have to have an entrance to the service corridor. Which could also mean that there might be a freight elevator going in back there. I doubt it, but it's a possibility. And then uh, another possibility could be we could get like an Otis elevator and a ThyssenKrupp escalator, or some combination like that with Kone Otis or ThyssenKrupp. I really have no idea. It's unpredictable at this point. Um, so yeah, there's been a lot of new -er announcements lately. Um, there's even some stores on this side, this side instead of this side, even though this side is being serviced, there's stores on this side that have been announcing their opening at the, around the same time. I'm guessing just to, you know, uh, spice up the, what, what should we call it, the foreshadowing, because along with that Forever 21, I'm not going to show the signs since there's like people, I guess, yeah. There's a Marmo, Marmont, however you say that, coming this fall. I'm guessing October-ish. And like, then there's a Burton there. Yeah. So, and now we will go upstairs. So, I'm gonna do the same thing I did earlier. And I will switch the videos up. Yep, we did another video switch. And now that we're upstairs been a couple more new announcements. This time even Hama store has been 
been waiting to open in a little while. Um, it's been, you know, getting ready for a while. And it is going to be the first to open out of the many stores. July 24th, which is in about a week, or no, two weeks, yeah, two weeks. A little more than two weeks. So, then we have an Athleta by Gap, same company that owns Old Navy and Piper Lime and Banana Republic. And of course, Gap. They're opening fall as well. It's really the only actual months that I know are Tommy Bahama, H&M, and Forever 21. But I'm sure that the store is around Forever 21 in this whole side of the wall and possibly even the two little ones downstairs. I'm sure that they'll all open up around the same time as Forever 21 in October. And then H&M is in September. So, now, for, you know what, I'm not going to make you sit and watch while I go outside, so we'll do yet another video switch. Yes, this is where we are. This parking deck. Level three. Basically, they paved and painted, and they've done everything with the sidewalks and stuff. They've plastered most of the out exterior walls, and let me show you what they're doing on the roof. Now, I've heard that this is to make, like things more economical for the mall and stuff. They're growing grass and stuff. I did the same thing at a local middle school. Radnor Middle School. Yeah. We're in Delaware County. It's sort of close to here. is in Radnor Township. So there's there's probably if you look on their website you can probably see the same thing and see what they've done with the roof. And I, I believe that they're doing the same thing. Just look it up on Google, Radnor Middle School. Alright. So yeah, if you look down there, that has a little bit of wires and stuff sticking out of it. That is where and over there that one too those are where the street lights are going to go the street lamps but it's not going to be there for long because the new expansion as in the one that runs from there all the way to here is supposed to be it's supposedly building it's spending, it's taking this whole part of the East Parking Deck, demolishing it, and building a new part of it right in this spot, connecting to that older part. Yeah. So, that's what they're doing. And, I don't really think there's anything else. Um, the service quarters, I don't know, I think I already about that the, about the layout and stuff if I had then I'll just the next time I film an update video I'll tell you um, you're probably getting bored out of your mind and I'm trying to think of what I was gonna say uh, oh yeah I'll show you this we're going to take the manpower elevator all the way down the one. Yes, we can do that now. There's the trusty old third floor light. So 
was earlier, a ghetto kid asked me if I had a lighter. I mean, seriously? I'm only 13. Almost 14. Alright, as you can see, they've taken the block off of the way down to one. Don't ask me what the beeping is, I have no idea. Oh, it stopped. Oh, never mind. It's probably a construction vehicle. Yeah, I have no idea what that is. So yeah, they've taken down this and they've added some stuff. Um, okay, it's yeah, it's one of those crane things. I'm just gonna go show you the around the corner part, but that ain't happening. So that is it.